Hello, today I'm going to show you how to get a memory dump or RAM acquisition. In short, I'm, I'm trying to get a copy of the RAM of Windows 10 machine. What tool we are going to use today is FTK Imager, Access Data FTK Imager. It's simple, straightforward. Uh, you can download FTK Imager from their website. Uh, it's free of charge. The version I'm using today is 4.7. To get memory dump, you just need to, uh, to click File, Capture Memory, and then select the destination uh, folder. I'm going to select the case where I save all my cases. Then you can name your memory dump whatever uh, you need. Okay, I will keep it memory dump for now. Then it's up to you to include the page file or create AD1 file or not, but however, it's recommend to include the page file because to make sure uh, if, <clears throat> if the system uh, wrote any memory information on the hard drive, you can recover that as well. But however, for the speed of today's uh, video, I will not going to select any of them. Then click capture and wait a couple of minutes. What you can see here, I got 22 gigabyte of RAM and this usually will take a couple of uh, minutes or seconds. <clears throat> I think the speed is quite uh, good. And the output after we finish, the, after the process is finished, you can view the output is here in cases memory dump but however it hasn't finished yet and the extension is mem uh, the memory file extension um, and after we will manage to get the memory dump we can validate um, the output okay we can validate the output just give it a couple of seconds And here is it successfully finished successfully. And here is it. We have 22 gigabyte of memory right now in, on on my machine. Uh, <clears throat> you can then you can have this memory dump and uh, use volatility three or volatility two point six or any other tools uh, to view uh, the information within this dump. Or however, I'm going to validate my answer using the same tool. Uh, using FTK Imager, I will go and <clears throat> add uh, evidence item, uh, folder, content folder, next. Then I will select the location from the cases and finish. Okay, here is um, our memory dump information. You can view all information, okay, using hexadecimal viewer. Okay, you can view registry data, you can view password, usernames, network information, and many, many more. Let me try this one. <clears throat> it will take time. Yeah, here is it. There is a ping uh, right now. As you can see, uh, I'm running ping, and we capture at the Bing uh, information, okay. If you are doing digital evidence, uh, it's straightforward. You, you can have uh, uh, this information, okay. Just search within the evidence, and you can notice here uh, I'm using <coughs> Bing.exe and I'm pinging 8.8.8 and 8. And there is more and more other information uh, you can find. You can find the passwords, you can find many other information. I will, I will keep this video short and I will stop here. Um, I will create another video how you can analyze the memory dump and looking for passwords, especially with the key pass. Thank you.